All right, guys, so we are super, super excited today to have a special guest in the Braille house. It is the one and the only Felipe. He's a sort of a superhero of sorts, straight out of the country of Brazil. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> he has the grip of a giant. He does not speak English, so we have a, a professional translator here. Professional and, translator? No. <laughs> yeah. Let's try to help you guys. So tell me, tell me the story. When he was six years old, he and his friend was on like a train rail. No! Like plane. It's so funny, before you even said that, I was like, something to have to do with the train is coming. Okay, so what happened? And they were playing there, and then they, they like, uh, just said, hey, come, Felipe, let's go to get a high on the train. He said, no, I can't. He said, yeah, yeah, you can, just go. Like, they insist to him. Yeah. To go. And then he, he, he saw the guys, like, trying. They used to make on the last wagon. Yeah. And he was in the middle. And the middle put him under that. And the train crashed his legs. The train ran over his legs. Yes. And just straight up cut them off. Actually, he told me that like, he, he, he got just one leg out. Yeah. And another one, they tried to keep it, but they, they couldn't. Then they had to amputate, the amputate other that leg. And that was when he was six years old. Yes. Wow. How old is he now? 19. 19. Wow. <laughs> and um, when did he pick up skateboarding? Com 13 anos de idade, eu ganhei um skate para mim me locomover mais fácil. E daí em diante, eu comecei a aprender manobras e tô até hoje andando de skate. When he was 13, he got a, like a skateboard from some friend, like I think like friend of his mom gave to her like a skateboard. They said, "Oh, give to Felipe. It's better to easy to move to you know like in, inside a house better than the wheelchair." Oh, I see. Sort and of then, like a practical thing. Yeah, I got and, it. And then he saw some guys skating, and then he he wanted to skate, and then he started to try tricks, and you know he's. Felipe known is now. <laughs> wow! <laughs> That's incredible. Yeah. I mean, I know how hard it is to, to skate just regularly. I can't even imagine what, yeah. what he's gone through and how he's had to progress. No one can, no one can imagine it. Só parece difícil, mas até que é um pouco fácil. He said it just seems like it's hard, but it's easy. It's like it's kind of easy. But for him, okay. you know, you know like, like, because he's a superhero. Yeah, yeah, he's a superhero. He yeah. had to learn. He said he has to learn, but like if he he doesn't have this accident, yeah. I think he won't be Felipe Nunes that we are, we know now, you know? That's like a blessing. It's not blessing like in a, disguise, they say. It, yes. Yeah. He kept his picture on Instagram that his life starts after the accident. This is right above the knee? Push it, push Does he have some kind of special... Oh, I see. I understand. Here, it's just like on the... like oh, above the knee. Oh, yeah. I got it. Like knee pads? There is nothing like he... Yeah, we are like trying to figure out something that can help him. He's always said, oh, this like uh, makes me look terrible when I try tricks, you know, like he, he doesn't like this thing. Yeah, like, he's gotten so used to it just I this don't way. know when someone invents something that he can put on this. I know somebody out there can invent this incredible thing to help him. Let's go, guys. Okay, so you tie this up. The é porque nessa perna eu não consigo, tipo, dobrar pra segurar assim. Essa aqui, ó, se eu colocar aqui embaixo, ó, ela fica ah. quietinha. Because on this leg, he doesn't have the knee, this part. Yeah. To, like, hold this, the, 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 the pants. pants oh, know? I see. So he, he only can, ties one yeah, side. Yeah, this yeah. one, he can. He puts the under here. Oh, he tucks and, it underneath like, there. Yeah. Wow. And he can skate better. But this one always, like, get like, like, uh, losing, you know? Yeah. That's why he has to tie it. So is he right foot forward or left foot forward? He's goofy. Okay. Yeah, sometimes Perfect. looks like, I don't know, when he does some tricks, yeah. looks goofy, but yeah. something looks nothing. <laughs> yeah, it looks like there's no stance. You know, yeah. yeah. Because he goes like, like this, like, like straight ahead, you yeah. know? Never know, but sometimes he does like a back over crook. We know that's back over crook because he say hey, it's back over crook. You know? <laughs> but if he does like this side, will be back over crook anyway. You know? Yeah. Come, he comes like in the back, Yeah. but he goes not like this. He goes like straight. And oh, back, yeah. but why back inside? You know, I don't know. Is what it is. Ele perguntou que base. Quer que eu falei que tem manobra que parece que não não tem não base. Não tem base. Que é o lado tipo você vai de lado, mas para você é. é back porque você, tem, você é. É, já sabe. Mas tem umas de back que vai de back mesmo, tipo tail de back, bird back. Yeah. E tem umas que vai de back. It's de like frente. when he does like back tail, you see like perfect back tail. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah. But like front side lip, he does front side lip when he turns. It looks like a shove out. But it's not shoving. It's like just, a, just out. You know. Uh -huh. So he could he can do handrails. Yes. So the first time he had to do a handrail, what was that first time? Você é um cara que não tem medo, dane-se. A primeira vez que você viu um corrimão, você vai falar, mano, 
Dani, você tá, vou me tacar ali e seja o que for. É, na, tipo, não cheguei a me jogar, mas eu fiquei trabalhando a minha mente. Aí, até a hora que eu tomei coragem, mas me cê, joguei. Mas você teve medo? O que você tinha? É, medo. É, he... Por ser escada, com o irmão descendo. No beginning, he got like a little scared of rails. Yeah. But like, he was like trying, like work on it, like keeping his mind. And once he got like courage to make it, he tried. Sim. The first try that he tried, he landed. What? That's incredible. Uh, okay, well, I'm super impressed. I think that you're going to inspire a lot of people to push forward in their own skateboarding and progress in their own skateboarding. Oh. So um, have fun in here. Yeah. Put your skate on. <laughs> whatever you want, whatever you want, you just have fun and skate. My mind is blown right now. Now! Okay, guys, we are here. Battle of the Goliaths. Felipe versus Carlos. <laughs> I know, I told you. He has the strongest hands. Rochambeau. Fight! Okay, full park, anything you want. Not only front lip, but he front lip the high one. He didn't go even on the low one. There you go. I've never backed by this rail. It's one. once 
guess we gotta play a round of flat ground as well. <laughs> What? Can you do it again? One more try. See, there she goes. <laughs> that was the most incredible thing I think I've ever seen ever. Living proof. Don't ever say you can't do anything. Right there. You can do it. <laughs> Hena and I, we have the YouTube channel, and Felipe was on a couple of videos there. We, we make like uh, this promotion with Felipe to bring him to Tampa. That was we, the, we the first thing. On our YouTube channel yeah. to help Felipe to, to come to Tampa last year, 2017. Yeah, and then Tony Hawk saw mm -hmm. our video on, on Instagram and then started to keep in touch with him, you know. Okay, so you guys have to follow their YouTube channel. The link to their YouTube channel will be in the description below. And we also have Felipe's Instagram. The link will be in the description below. So go give them a follow, give them some support, and let's leave some positive comments and let them know. He's like a shining example of what can be done despite any and all obstacles. So you guys can get out there and skate and have fun and progress on your boards. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> You killed it. You killed it. <laughs> so we hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, like, and leave a comment below. Oh, hey. Didn't see you there. I was just signing posters for everybody that gets something at BrailleSkateboarding.com this holiday season. Wow. Slid right in there. The box of your dreams. We got handboards. We got bow ties. We got a box. And I got a knife. We're going to open this box nice. We got everything on sale right now at BrailleSkateboarding.com for Black Friday. It is up to 50% off selected items. We have many different skateboards. We have completes. We have blank decks, t-shirt hoodies, all the new handboard designs, hoodies, tons of different hats, skater trainers, more handboards, skateboarding made simple volumes. You guys are going to need those. We got volume one. We got volume one through six. We have DVDs. We have digital downloads. We have all different kinds of grip tape and everything else that you would ever need to learn how to skateboard. So go to BrailleSkateboarding.com right now. It's Black Friday. You guys know what to do. Up to 50% off all of these items. The store is totally stocked up, so go there and get what you need. BrailleSkateboarding.com. Have a great Christmas.